That looked awesome. Hey guys, it's Bendy Penguin 64 Welcome back to Ty the Tasmanian Tiger. In the last episode, we got started on Outback Safari and made some really good progress despite my initial fears that this level would give me a lot of trouble. Although, of course, we're yet to finish it, so there might be an opal or two somewhere that I've missed. But it all seems to be going alright so far. And there will be a thunder egg that we can take care of around here. But, oh my god, this is box heaven. Look at look at all these boxes. Don't miss any though. Look at all these boxes. I'm I'm very oh Bilby right there as well. I'm very pleased to see that. Okay, so all the golden cogs, all the Bilbies. Now it's just opals. Although it doesn't look like there's quite enough around here. Um and oh I forgot if you crash into houses they will actually crumble. That's actually pretty funny. Uh, can I just get out of here? Mm, let's see, is there anything around here? I can't remember. Can they hide opal boxes in these sheds? I'm pretty sure they can't. They're not that sneaky. But it's always a good idea to check. And I'm not trying to knock over these buildings. I, I swear I'm not trying to. I'm just going about my business. And that one didn't crumble. I'm surprised, but I'll take it. Uh, any, any more boxes? There's a life there. I might as well take that. Uh, let's see. Oh, there's some on the road. Of course, it's the most obvious ones that I miss. It's just my luck. But, okay, we're coming up to 250. Uh, yep, 250 right here. Come on, show me that magic number. Beautiful. And still got a couple more to go. And, yeah, I think that should just about do it for this place. Although, there's probably an opal or two around. Yep, yep, a couple more boxes. And... Yeah, like I say, no more golden cogs or bilbies, so we're just looking for boxes. And I saw them over here. Yep, there's a few more down here. Uh, how many is that altogether? I think that's the end of it. I don't want to speak too soon, but I think that's about all of the boxes around here. In which case, while I'm in the neighbourhood, I might as well take care of a uh, Thunder Egg mission. So, hey Ranger Ken, how you doing? Well, I can certainly try. Yeah, I remember when I was a kid, I could never figure out what this was asking me to do. Yeah, it turns out you're supposed to do that. Just crash into the, uh, into the sides of the towers and they crumble. I don't know how I didn't figure that out when I was a kid. For some reason, I was thinking, like, what am I supposed to do? Although, to be fair... Oh, no, wait, you don't have to actively slam into them. You can just run into them and it does, does them automatically. Okay. Uh, is this one of them? Okay, well, that one doesn't work. And Oh, okay, so actually look out for the water towers near the burning buildings, in which case... Uh, where, where's the last one? Oh, wait a minute. Am I su oh, you're supposed to do it in an order, I think? Well, thanks for that. You, di you didn't tell me that before. Ch cheers for that. You expect me to figure it out by myself. Kind of a mug, do you think I am? Oh, well, I was a mug enough to actually do it for everyone, so... Oh, well, a hero's work is never done. Right, uh, let me just take a look at the map. Um, yeah, I think uh, I think there is one more section of the road that we haven't explored yet. Although, while I'm on my way, I will be exploring the perimeter just in case. Careful, careful. Avoid the rocks, because I think we only have... Oh, we, we had two hit points. Okay, I thought I was completely screwed. No, no, it's okay. We have one more to boot. What was that? Nothing. I, I thought I saw something. Yep, there's more boxes down here. And there's plenty in the perimeter. So keep an eye out for those. No, 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 no. Tornado, leave me alone. Don't you dare. I'm not in the mood today. I've got one hit point. And I'm trying to get my duties finished around this level. And nope, nothing there. Okay, that's already sorted. Uh, any around this perimeter? And Oh, God, it's sucking me in. <laughs> um... Can I avoid that? Actually, are there... An is it blocking any boxes? Because it probably is. Okay, I'm going to... Oh, for God's sake. Well, we get a good look at the scenery anyway. And no, I don't think there's anything here. I was... Well, I was hoping it wasn't guarding any boxes. And I don't think it is. Wait, where am I now? Uh, thanks for that. Bathroom break over. Back in action. Right. Uh, yep, yeah, we're back here. So, it's okay. It's, it's just a stone's throw away. Or in this case, a lacerang's throw away. 
And I believe that this is actually the only level in this game where we actually get to use that, where we get like a, uh, a boomerang on a string, which is going to be important for uh, a thunder egg later in this level. But first, if I can just get out of the way, come on, come on, you can do it. Come on, put your backs into it. There we go. Sorted. Uh, and I'm going to keep breaking down those sheds just in case there's anything of interest. Although at this point, we have taken care of all the bilbies and golden cogs. And I don't think they actually hide opal boxes in there. Although to be fair, like maybe they do when they're trying to psych me out. I don't know. Uh, let's see. Keep exploring the perimeter every now and then. Uh, nope, no tornadoes. So we're free to just muck about. Oh, extra life. Okay, I'll take that. Makes up for the one I lost a few minutes ago. Uh, let's see. Don't want to go too fast. I do want to go, like, at a, at a brisk pace, but not so brisk that I actually miss anything that's directly in front of me. Uh, yep, just tilt the camera down. and uh, it's, it's really difficult to orient the camera at a constant tilt. So, like, it doesn't tilt all the way down. It just tilts slightly. I don't know. I'm, I'm finding it difficult at least, but to be fair, I, I find a lot of things difficult. It's not exactly a surprise that I'd be having trouble. Well, once again, blame it on the camera controls. Do what I do best. Oh, God, no. I, I think we're about to reach the end of the line. Still got 12, 12 opals. Um, oh, yeah, yeah. That looks like the end of the road. Uh, is there anything I missed? Oh, God, no. Anything at all? No, nothing, no, nothing at all. No one? No? Oh, 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 oh for God's sake. <sighs> I was hoping it wouldn't come to this. We missed 10 opals. Uh, okay, Shazza, I will get to you in a second. Just give me a moment to... Wait. Oh, God, I can't get out of this way. Uh, okay, I thought I was stuck for a second. Uh, you know what, Shazza, I will see you for a second. Oh, no, this thunder egg. Oh, this is so tedious. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll get it done while I'm in the neighbourhood. Yeah, the Lassaran gets two introductions in this level. Awesome. It's just that awesome. Right, as I recall, ten whole minutes, in which case... Well, hopefully that's plenty of time for us to look around for boxes as well. But, yeah, basically the way this goes is that the place is full of emus, and, oh, now I remember, you have to hold square to reel them in. You throw the Lassaran, and if it hits them, then just hold square to reel them in. Yeah, I thought it was... I thought I had to tap them for a second. No, it's okay. And if the bar fills before they actually reach you, then you have to lasso it again. Yeah, it's, it's not very... Oh! Oh, ho, ho! I will gladly take that. Thank you kindly. Thank you, Shazza. You put me exactly where I needed to be. Um, yeah, as I recall, this mission's not too tricky, but it's very tedious because the emus are just scattered all over the place. Uh, although, actually, now that I think about it, they're probably back there. Oh, was that a box? No. Oh, dearie me. Uh... Right, where are the emus? Show me the emus. Aha, there you are. Come on, come on. No, no, no. Stay put. There we go. Oh, that'll be easy. Oh, sorted. That was easy. Reeled it in split second. Oh, come on. Oh, there's a there's another box in the center of the road. How am I missing the... Oh, okay, I was paying so much attention to the perimeter where they're more likely to hide the boxes that I missed the ones that were right in front of my face. Okay, there you go. Just... Focusing on the wrong thing. Whoa, what was that? What was that? I saw something. No, 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 no. Don't lie to me, game. I... Wait a minute. Um, Lassaran, could you not work at that proximity, even though it was right in front of you? But, oh, for God's sake, stop ducking behind the rock. No, 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 no. Get over here. Get over here. I'm Scorpion. Come on, get in, get in. Oh, for God's sake. That, that little bleeder. That was a pain in the arse, wasn't it? Um, okay, that only took a minute and a half so far. We've still got plenty of time to get this done. Wait, where are you? Where are you? Get over here. What the? Okay, that was some really awkward ranging, but I'm not complaining. Got the job done. Uh, two more, two more. Uh, where are you? Uh, any around here at all? None. Uh, what the? Uh, please, please comply. Comply, thank you. There we go, sorted. Right, just one more and... Uh, I do want to keep exploring to see if there's any boxes. What was that? I thought I I thought I saw one of the emus for a second. I was probably wrong. 
Um, where are you? Where are you? Aha! There you are. Stay perfectly still. Stay perfectly still. Only I may run around this perimeter. Uh, no boxes. Right, well, I've got no talks to do, so you, you, stay put. Stay put. St where are you? Stay put. Stop moving. Stop so I can reel you in and take you back to the farm where you'll be tortured horribly. Okay, there we go. New Thunder Egg and... Okay, how many opals do we have? Eight. We still got... Oh, oh, oh we still got eight of them. Oh, for God's sake. Um, okay, anything at all still hanging around uh, the entrance. And I'm going to keep knocking down these sheds just to make sure. Nothing? No? Nout. Absolutely nout. And Okay, thanks for that camera. Just give me a nice, clear view of that beautiful tree. Um, come on, what's, where are the, okay, there's no boxes around here, I don't think, I'm pretty sure, like, just for a moment, I just want to explore this, uh, grass, and you know what, there's probably someone watching this video thinking, you idiot, the, there was a box right in front of you, you didn't see it, I'm sorry if anyone talks like that, I wasn't trying to do an offensive accent, I was just, no, 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 no disrespect to anyone who spotted something that I didn't. If anything, I'm glad that you spotted something that I didn't because it proves that you are smarter than me. Yeah. Although, to be fair, that's not really much of an accomplishment because I'm easy competition. Okay, here we go. Race time. While I'm in the neighborhood, might as well get this done. And, yeah, Shazza has said that uh, her old truck isn't fast enough to catch up with the emus, and yet she expected me to do better with with the emu, so, I don't know, I'm freezing my sentence poorly, it's like, she expects me to be faster than her at emu catching, but she doesn't expect me to be faster than her at racing, so like, just walking along the road, and oh wait, as I recall, tornadoes really screw you up in this race, but you are allowed to cut corners significantly, so you don't have to stick to the road, like, you see that, lots of corner cutting, although, to be fair, like, uh, I'm controlling this thing poorly, what, oh, damn it, my greed got the better of me. I, I swear I thought there was a box there in the grass. Uh, no such luck. Okay, are there any around here that I missed? Because I feel like it's very, very likely. And I thought I saw one out of the corner of my eye, but I think it was just grass again. Yeah, see, that's the thing. The thing about this level is that it plays tricks with your mind. Like, you're constantly thinking, was that a box? Was it? Show me a box, I'm going crazy. Well, I might be going crazy in a second. Uh, let's see. I'm pretty sure we have to do the slam move in order to get over there. Nope, that was not a box. It was just a big old rock. Uh, how far away is Shazza, actually? I want to orient the camera behind me, but it's probably, go it's probably going to screw me over, and I'm going to completely butcher the last part of this race. Uh, anything around here? Nothing? No? No? Oh, okay, then. I'll take it. Right. Epic jump, and I'm pretty sure we got everything around here. Unless there's something around the perimeter that I completely missed. Oh, you know what? Oh, no, 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 don't you dare. You know what? I think there might be. I'm thinking that maybe there was something around the perimeter of the opal machine that I might have missed, but Shazza, where are you going? I, oh, I thought that was a box. No, it wasn't. It was just another rock stump. Shazza, you're a machine. No, 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 no. If you steal this right from under my nose at the last second... I will turn my whole bedroom upside down. Okay, I think I think using the slam move will make you go a bit faster. No, 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 Shazza, Shazza, you stay out of my way. Because I really need that thunder egg to save the world and to make me feel good about myself. Uh, oh, God, no, there's a tornado right in front of us. No, no, no. Okay, is Shazza affected by tornadoes? No, she's not. She's not, you cheating, you cheating monster, you. No, no, no. Shazza, Shazza, slow down, you you cruel woman. Or whatever the female term for a Tasmanian tiger is. No, actually, no, she's not a Tasmanian tiger at all, is she? She's a dingo, isn't she? I think. Oh, that was close. <sighs> oh, good God, that, that got really tense at the end. You know, you know what, Shazza, big... I don't even know what that means. I think it's a kind of duck. I'm not sure what that means, like... Some kind of Australian lingo. Yeah, you know what, Shazza? Shazza, big thumbs up from me. 
because that was some epic racing and you should be very proud of yourself. Um, oh, actually, you know what? Once again, while I'm in the neighborhood, I might as well get this Thunder Egg knocked out because it shouldn't be too much trouble. Once again, I can certainly try. As I recall, Shazza has. Yep, she does. She has a uh, she has a health bar in this one, so she can take a bit of a beating. Okay, do, do not take that out of context. I do not encourage the beating of female dingoes. Oh wait, yeah, I remember these guys. So. Oh, yeah, we can rang them. I couldn't remember if we had to slam them or rang them, but no, sure enough, ranging works as well. In fact, ranging probably works... Ranging works much, much better. Okay, forget it. Screw slamming. I'm just going to keep ranging them because... Like, look look at that. that. Look how easy that was. We're making absolute mincemeat out of them. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, no, no. Oh, for God's sake. Into the tornado. I'm Dorothy. Come on, get me out of there. Thank you. Right, let's not have another... Oh! 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 Happy days, there was a box right there. Thank you, Tornado, for actually pointing me towards that. You're not a bad guy, you just misunderstood. Wait, hang on, where did Shazza go? Uh, I, I lost Shazza. Shazza, where are you? And she's taking serious damage. Oh, God, she's, she's going to die in a minute. I don't know where she went. I was, I was distracted by my own greed. I wasn't trying to let you down, I swear. Oh, Shazza, I'm sorry. Well, I hope you do. Yeah, sure thing. Uh, that wasn't a question, but yes. Okay, right, this is it. This is it. We've got, that, we've got our game faces on. Yeah, we're not, we're not letting Shazza down. Don't worry, Shazza. I've learned my lesson. I'm not going to let greed get the better of me. Although, at this point, I probably should. Because I'm really clutching at straws to find all those opals. Okay, you die. You, what do you? Oh, that was a that was a slow tumble. Okay, fair enough. Sorted. Okay, boom. Sorted. And you, you, boom. Sorted. Like the Lasseranga's weird movements, doesn't it? Uh, right. Uh, Shazza, where are you going? Oh, there's two of them around here. Uh, sh she's going this way, isn't she? Is she? Wait, where are you? Shazza, where are you? Aha, there it is. Yeah, that was the problem. I went the wrong way the first time. Alright, uh, how many more thrills out here? And I'm still keeping an eye out for boxes just in case. Uh, Lasserang, yeah, deal with that. Come on, Lasserang, deal with it. I don't know why. Sometimes it hits and sometimes it doesn't. It's it's, it's weird, man. Uh, oh, oh, box right in the... Oh, I see them. I see them. I'm taking them. No. Oh, Shazza, I said I wouldn't get greedy, but... I need these things. Shazza, I'm sorry. You can forgive me for a few... For a few, like, punches or whatever kind of weapon it is they're using. Like, I don't know if this is like solid fist fighting. Although I don't know how you do that on a motorbike. Okay, you, you, die now. Oh, that was close. Okay, no, 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 no. Don't hold me back. Okay, please tell me. Please tell me there are some opals hanging about here. Preferably two, because that's exactly what I need. Come on. Anything? Anything? I can't see because of the camera. No. <sighs> okay. Oh, ho, ho, Shazza. I said I wouldn't get greedy, but I can't help it. It's the Opals. They call me like a siren song. I'm actually getting a bit teary-eyed right now. I'm getting way too dramatic. I'm, I'm sorry, Shazza. Okay, in all seriousness, how much further do we have to go? Because I think we just did a whole lap of the place. I think. I think we're about done. Please tell me we are. I'm pretty sure this is where we started. This it. This it. Journey's end. Sweet. There we go. Sweet. Okay. Uh, how much more do we need to get accomplished in this place? Oh, sweet. Okay. All the bilbies. All the golden cogs. All we need now is two bloody opals. Right. Okay. 
Well, in that case, hopefully this level won't take me uh, too long to complete. Hopefully this level will actually take less time to finish than shipwrecks. I would appreciate that very much. So I think I'll cut ahead to when I find those next two boxes. I'm pretty sure I know where at least one of them might be. I'm pretty sure I might have missed a couple near Julius's Opal machine. I, I don't know why, but I've got a hunch. So I'm gonna cut. Uh, I'm gonna cut over to there, or rather, I'm just gonna cut to when I find the two boxes. But if they are near Julius's Opal machine, I'm gonna feel very pleased with myself. Right. With that said, cutting ahead. Oh, what was that? Oh my God! Yes. Right next to Julius's open machine, not quite where I was expecting. I was expecting them to be more over this side, like next to where these trees are. Like, hang on. Yeah, here. I thought they'd be around here, but they were next to Julius's open machine. I was close enough, and I will gladly take that. Now, give me my thunder egg and my epic disp... Oh, for God's sake. It didn't gravitate towards me. I moved out of the way. I, I nearly screwed myself out of a thunder egg. Oh, for God's sake. And I will finish watching this glorious display just while I'm in the neighbourhood. Okay, there we go. Sorted. That's all of the opals. And, yep. So, is that everything? Yeah, ten golden cogs and all of the thunder eggs. I'm very, very, very pleased with that. It only took me uh, 43 minutes of recording overall. So, yeah, that's a big improvement considering that shipwrecks took 15 minutes about. Actually, no, I think it might have been even longer. I'm not even sure. But, oh well, sorted, over and done with. One of the most, uh, I'm not sure if infamous is the right word. Like, I'm not sure how many people would consider that to be a torturous level to collect anything, but I certainly do. Like, even though I do like that level a lot, like, it, it's just so torturous to find everything. But you know what? That was actually a really, really good run. So... Yeah, I'm very happy with how that turned out. So, yeah, great note to end this episode on. So, thanks for watching, and next time on Time the Tasmanian Tiger, we'll be going to one of the other portals to see what they have in store for us. So, thanks for watching, and Ty, please stop doing that. You are freaking me out. Especially with the flame effect under you, then it looks really, really sadistic.